wide receiver 11, Juju Smith-Schuster, and I have him way higher than most people. I didn't want to have him this high, but then I was looking at stats, I was reading a bit, I was looking back at stats from a couple years ago when he had Big Ben, and I know Antonio Brown was there, which helps. But he wasn't that bad last year. I mean, he was down the stretch when Duck Hodges came in, because Duck Hodges is terrible. Somehow worse than Mason Rudolph. I don't even know how that's possible. But he's considerably worse than Mason Rudolph. Um, Juju, the 42 for 552, three touchdowns, 13.1. It's obviously not good, but only 12 games that he played, had some injuries. Um, and Mason Rudolph and Duck Hodges are just the worst. He gets Big Ben back. Big Ben, something to prove. People wondered if he'd come back. People said he was done. They'll say that again throughout this season. I think Juju's going to be back to where he was two years ago or close to it. Uh, obviously, I don't think he'll ever... It, it doesn't help when you don't have Antonio Brown across from you attracting all that attention. But I think Juju showed enough the year when Antonio Brown was there that he he can separate. He can get himself open. He, he makes catches. He's, he's good for the explosive play. Um, so I think Juju has a good year and vastly, vastly improves these numbers to wide receiver one status. I, again, I didn't want this. I didn't want to rate him this highly, but I just kept looking, reading, uh, looking at metrics, looking at numbers, and, and Juju seems to be a guy that had a great year, very down year, but now is due for a breakout as he gets a competent quarterback back um, in a system that, that they both know pretty well.